camel toe. Oh, oh, Jesus Christ. Half an hour set. All right, uh, yes, my government name is Young Camel Toe. Obviously, my jersey says it, so uh, that's, that's how that works. Uh, all hell, Tom Brady. Uh, we're going to win the championship this year. I don't care how you feel about that. It's my birthday today. Happy birthday, young Camel Toe, man. We just turned 22 years old, man. 22 years young, actually. That's how that works in my timeline. Uh, uh, so, uh, just so y'all know, um, I'm a Cash App Sun, I'm a Venmo Moon, I'm a PayPal Rising, and my Zodiac sign is Zell. At, you guessed it, Young Camel Toe in the building. That's what we doing today. Um, today's Friday, tomorrow is Saturday, just so you know, I'm gonna go to Chick-fil-A and buy a whole lot of sandwiches on Saturday, then I'm gonna sell them on Sunday for six dollars and sixty-six cents. So if you happen to want a Chick-fil-A sandwich on a Sunday, holla at yes, you guessed it. Let's go. That's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm doing, man. I'm a good man. I'm a very good man. I'm talking to you. I'm a good man. And uh, toxic positivity, we gotta cut that out. Cause I'm a good man, and I just wanna have a good message cause that's what good men do. All right, now on to the next thing I was about to talk about. The mushrooms just kicked in, so we gonna use some cheat codes real quick. All right, I like to do yoga after sex, not because I like to do yoga, but I'm just waiting for my intuition to kick in to tell me if I should hit it again. Yes, that's what I do. I do yoga right after sex. A lot of white women love it. A lot of black women are confused. And the Mexicans, they're like, all right, let's try this out. So shout out to the Mexicans for doing yoga after sex with me. Uh, that's what we're talking about. I'm running for president. In a couple of years, I heard you have to be 35, I'm 22, so I'm just gonna wait until I'm 35 so I can run for president because uh, Biden, he's doing a great job because my stocks are great. Thank you, Biden. Uh, I'm not being facetious at all. Uh, Donald Trump, um, I mean, hey, if you get it, I could do it. Uh, thank you, base guy, you can could, you could fuck my bitch type shit, you know what I mean? Uh, let's see, uh, according to my vaccination card, I was vaccinated yesterday. According to my PPP loan, I own a couple of multi-billion dollar businesses. And according to this joke, this is not a joke. This is what I'm talking about. All right. Uh, I went, uh, I went to the doctors and they gave me a little uh, pamphlet. They were like, uh, would you like to donate your organs if you die? Like, first of all, I'm immortal, bitch. I can never die. And then I was like, but if I do happen to die, uh, just I just want you to donate my penis. But you can only donate my penis to like uh, a, a chick who's above an eight on the Richter scale, and she's trying to transition into a dude. Because my dick only goes into the baddies and my dick is only gonna go to a bay. That's what I'm trying to say. This is a horrible joke to say in San Francisco, so that's why I said it. Uh, I was talking to a veteran comedian the other day, and he said, if you don't remember your jokes, and you happen to be doing mushrooms, you should write them on your hand. I was like, cool, that's a good ass tip. And then he told me, uh, and if you feel a little bit anxious because of the mushrooms, you go into the bathroom and jack one off real quick. Uh, I wish you would have told me those uh, suggestions in reverse order because it's kind of hard to read these jokes right now. <laughs> they call me Young COVID Toe now. No, that's a joke. That's not, I don't know what I'm doing. Uh, marriage is a gateway drug to divorce. I uh, just want to say that. Uh, I'm planning to get married on my deathbed so I can just skip that part. And uh, these jokes are fucking great. You know, mushrooms work fantastically well, especially when you're in a unicorn onesie with a whole bunch of lights in your face. This is amazing, man. I went to this dude in Berkeley. He was like, hey, man, I got Thrasher and I got Golden Teacher. And I'll give you a whole ounce for $100. I got $100 right now. He was like, I 
But when you take these drugs, man, I promise you, every time you take the mushrooms, you're gonna take them both at the same time. And uh, I shook on it, man. I, I gave him a pinky promise. So, uh, damn. I don't know. I don't know where we're going with this. These jokes are hard to read. Some people play chess. Some people play Monopoly. I don't know where I'm going with this uh, joke. I just like to play Pokemon. I see the light in the back. Does that mean I got a minute or 30 seconds? Well, I could last longer than that in the sack in case you were wondering. In case you're transitioning, this dick got more than a minute and 30 seconds. You're welcome. I got you. Told my grandpa the other day, he's like, you know what's wrong with your generation, sonny boy? I'm like, nah, grandpa, what's the problem? He said, look, this is the problem, man. He said, your generation relies too much on technology. I was like, nah, grandpa, your generation relies too much on technology. And then I uh, unplugged his life support. <laughs> I plugged it back in though, because he's paying my rent. Um, and the rent was just due. Well, anyway, my name is Young Cowboy Toe, Cash App, Venmo, PayPal. These jokes are fantastic. I hope you have a wonderful, happy birthday, Young Cowboy Toe, Christmas and Jimmy. Uh, and I'm out. Time for Young Camel everybody. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah.